Frozen TV is gonna bring you snow cycles. Have you ever ripped it before? Oh yeah. Season TV coming at you from the Moss Brooks Speed Shop. I'm here with Kevin Adams. He's known for showing some pretty sick parties. This one just so happens to be the showcase of the snow cycle. Tell me what it is about the snow cycle. What we got here is a conversion kit for your dirt bike. Take any type of dirt bike, 250cc and above. You add this track system to the existing suspension. There's an adjustability on the front ski. The setting is in the middle right now for intermediate terrain. The wheels are for when you come to a road crossing or you need to move the motorcycle on your paved area. You just roll the bike just like you would with the tire. Ross Powers ripping it on a snow cycle here on Steez and TV. Dude, that's awesome. I'm confused on what we got here. This is the rear end. What am I looking at? What you have here, Cam, is a track assembly. You remove the rear wheel. It's installed with a hub system, which there's a constant pressure from a bogey underneath the track, and that keeps constant pressure on this wheel from underneath. Now, I saw them moving it back and forth. Yeah. That adjusts for... Really simple cam. What you have is this slide rail, and then you loosen these three nuts on each side. You're able to grab the hub, and in this scenario, it would be pulling it backwards and moving it either to the middle, which would be for intermediate train, or all the way forward for a powder. All right, now I saw these guys riding around with the gas can on. That's for really long trips and stuff. Sure. How does that work? If you're gonna go for an extended period of time, what you'd like to do is add this option. It's a rack that can carry your gas or any other type of extra necessities you'd need to Six go on. Six packs of beers. Yeah, there you go. Right It'll probably actually accommodate an 18 pack. There you go. <laughs> so what you do is it gets mounted right up here on this existing frame, right into this area and it's stabilized with these bolt patterns. You may even be able to strap your snowboard on here to do some backcountry snowboarding. All right, so I've never seen these before. Are, are they new to the market or, or, or how long have they been around? Uh, in this format, it's new, but we've actually been using a lot of these components for about nine years now in other products that we offer. It's a conversion kit for your four-wheeler cam. If I wanted to buy this for, for my dirt bike, where would I go? Sure, well, Cam, we're the regional dealer for Vermont at Vermont Snow Cycles, but you can go online and find them at ExploreMoto.com and there's dealerships all across the country and Canada. Talk to your local dealer, we get you out on a demo ride. That's key, ride before you buy. If I can get someone to cart my up into the trees and then I can shred a little bit, I feel like my life would be a lot easier thanks to you guys. Sure, you're not gonna have to be a rocket scientist to figure out a way to strap a couple snowboards on there and get a couple of your buddies up to the hill. Kevin, thanks a lot for having us. Yeah, Cam, great really having you guys out here today. So if you guys are looking for this, go to exploremoto.com or just check it out here on Season TV. And you know what? We're actually gonna be hooking up with these guys at the quarters anyway. So up uh, at yeah. Temper Ridge, right? Yeah, I hear, yeah. I hear he's quite the pyro, so we can thank <laughs> him for some of our techniques out there. Uh -huh.